I was just reading uh, uh, reasoning from the scriptures, uh, it's the Jehovah's Witness Bible. They give it to the baptized ones. Uh, this is my sister. She gave it to me since uh, now she's born again Christian and she's saved. She let me have this and I dig through it and uh, I mean it's just amazing. Um, anyway, I was reading about how they reason, the Watchtower reasons with Jesus being Michael the Archangel and they base it on Daniel chapter 10 verses 13. But if you read that, and Daniel, this is all, this is a question to all of you Jehovah's Witnesses. If Michael, the chief prince or the foremost prince, that qualifies him to be Jesus Christ, that's not how it reads in Daniel, in your, you know, the New World Mistranslation Bible. It reads like this, if I can find it quickly. Okay, here it is. It reads like this. Daniel chapter 10 verses 13 it reads like this but the prince of the royal Rome of Persia was standing in opposition to me from 21 days this is an angel talking to Daniel he's telling him a story of a battle that was you know that happened up in Persia and he said and look Michael one of the foremost princesses came to help me he tells him one of the foremost princesses came to help me so okay if Michael is Jesus Christ, okay? And the reason you guys say he's Jesus Christ because he is a chief prince, but it says he's one of the foremost. So he's one of the chief princesses. That's why he's Jesus Christ. Then, if he's one of the chief princesses, then how many Jesus Christs are out there? Because he's one of the, the chief prince, princesses. So there's a bunch of other chief angels out there that are qualified to be Jesus Christ, according to your teaching. Okay? So can you please answer that? How many Jesus are out there? 